guys, welcome back to another video. I'm Rose. That's Blue that you're hearing. He is just meowing out of control. Tis the season. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I guess he wants to be in the video. Anyways, today we're gonna be making some Kung Pao sauce uh, tofu. It's gonna be yummy and delicious. So let's get veggie. All right, so first things first, we're gonna add about a tablespoon maybe not even, of oil into our pan here. I have this on a medium heat, medium high-ish heat. And the first thing we're adding in is soy sauce. The full recipe will be linked down below. As usual, I'm looking at my, uh, my recipe right here. I'm also adding in a bit of hoisin sauce. We are adding in a little ketchup or ketchup. All right, we've got two tablespoons, two teaspoons. No, yeah, two tablespoons of sugar. And I also have some ground black pepper in there. And we have some better than bouillon uh, vegetable waste. So this is like that delicious, kind of like chicken brothy kind of. Uh, chicken stock kind of a uh, deal. This stuff is delicious. I'm sorry, it's half a teaspoon, not a whole teaspoon. I am tripping right now. The cat has me tripping. Okay, next we're adding in some uh, garlic powder. I could, you could definitely do garlic cloves. Uh, whenever I feel like going the extra mile, I will do garlic cloves. But, you know, it's no big deal. Still gonna taste good. Either way, it's gonna be good. All right. That's that. At this point, you can taste it and um, see if you like it. If you don't like it, you can add a little bit more sugar, um, a little bit more anything, pretty much. Ooh, yep. That's on the good stuff, that's the good stuff. And then, all we're gonna do is add in our tofu. And normally, this is actually pressed tofu. Normally, uh, I would kind of like cook my tofu a little bit before to kind of like dry it a little bit, but it's really not necessary in this, in this recipe. Especially if you're like a big fan of tofu, you don't necessarily have to do all that. So yeah, we're gonna let this cook for about three minutes on each side, and then we'll be good to go. All right, so I'm gonna flip this guys over, these guys over, it's been three minutes. See how it's like nice and coated, and it looks all yummy. That's what we're looking for. Um, every stove is different, so if you feel like yours is kinda like sticking too much, or um, if your tofu starts to like burn, definitely put your heat down a little. Our tofu is done. It is all sauced up. And I'm getting ready to just place it or, uh, what's it called? Plate it um, into a bed of noodles. And this is just some ramen that we have here. And also some, uh, what is it called? Cucumber because for some reason, I love cucumber with my ramen. I don't know why, but I just do it, I just do. So, there you have it, that is it. All right guys, so this is taste test time, and we're going in. Oh, oh, oh yes, oh, it has like a little kick to it, really, really good. You guys have to try this out. Let me know what you guys think. Yep. Mm. You know, I'm not normally a really big fan of tofu, especially when it's not like pressed really, really well. But this, this right here, this right here, I love it. So try it out. Let me know what you guys think. Don't forget to tag me on Instagram at Veggie Rose using the hashtag veggie fam if you make this recipe or any of my other recipes i would love to know what you think love to know what you uh thought about it what huh <laughs> all right guys so thank you guys so much for watching i love you guys 
and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye!